Hey everybody, Bubble Pop Kids here, get ready for Candy Bonanza. Got tons of sweetie treats up on the chest and table today. Oh, we even have a half pound, if you can believe this, it is a sugar daddy pop. Oh, look at this thing, it's huge, it's like for a giant. Love the caramel. That's not the only lollipop, you also have a big poop swirl. Looks good, is it poop flavored? Gonna find out. Last time I was at Universal Studios and I stopped at Harry Potter World. I love that place. I love it almost as much as Disney. I picked this up. It is so weird. It's called Shock O Chalk. Add some shock to your chocolate. Uh, Bubble, that little girl is like really scaring me. She looks like a vampire. But then this little boy looks even worse. Are they like wizards? The one I'm super excited about, we got some Jelly Belly. Last time we had one of these boxes, it was like the DC superheroes. This time, I got the Trollies. We got Poppy, Branch, all the other little crazy ones. And these are the Fleas. Christmas is just three days away, and I am doing a Christmas candy bonanza, but I threw this little one in here. Bottle Pop. And all festive on us. I love you, Bubble. Look at the top of the bottle. Looks like a candy cane. This is Christmas Bottle Pop. Cherry vanilla flavor. Adorb. We got this little one right here. I don't know what it is, but I picked it up because of that chubby little baby. It's called Botan Rice Candy. And there's a free children's sticker inside. <laughs> I just don't get it. Is it going to look like rice or chocolate? It's going to be a mystery. He's cute. What else? Couple more crazy little candies here. Ooh, this one is really weird. <laughs> and it's so cute at the same time. This is called fairy food. And if you can see those little candies, I don't know, they look like gummies. Fairy food is lollipops, Belgian chocolate buttons, and luxurious candies. Like, what does that mean? The box is so, so adorable. I don't know what to expect with this. I don't know what to expect? What do you mean, Bubble? It's like fairy food. I eat that all the time. We have this gigantic bag of gummies. Look at this thing, it's huge. And the funny part about it, there are 12 flavors. These are like gourmet. Oh yeah, these are the Happy Yummies, world's best tasting gourmet gummies. It's like a rhyme with two extra special flavors, black cherry and strawberry banana. 14 flavors in total. This thing is amazing. Love that. And your final thing we're gonna be trying is this giant cola bottle. Look at this thing, it is huge. It is the world's biggest gummy cola bottle. And I don't know what the flavor is. Is it gonna taste like soda? It's so squishy. We're gonna chop this thing up and taste. So there it is, my little bubble teenies. We got nine different candies to test out, see what's going on here. Let's do this. I cannot believe you. You're starting with the fairy food. Ooh, this is enchanting. The box looks like wallpaper. I love it. Kicking off the bananas with the fairy food. You know, I have never seen a box as cute as this one. It's so, so decorated and cute. And it says lollipops, Belgian chocolate buttons, and luxurious candies. Like, I don't know if all that stuff is in here. Try it. What? <laughs> like, what in the world is going on? Inside of this box, we got exactly what it said. We got the lollipop right here. Look at this thing. Gorgeous. We also got the Belgian chocolate buttons right here. And the third, luxurious candy. Oh, yeah. Pretty luxurious. <laughs> this is so, so weird. Three different candies in that box. The fairy food. This is crazy. So we got these little Belgian chocolate buttons. Ooh, I love a good chocolate. Test it. Chocolate buttons rock. Love that. Mm, delicious. You cannot beat a Belgian chocolate. Oh, I got a whole bunch of them here. So creamy, so milky. Love it. Now we're going for these luxurious candies. They look like little candy canes, except they're almost like a pink color. What are those going to taste like? Ooh, they're squishy. Of course they're squishy. They're like little squishy fairy gumdrops. That's what the fairies eat. Let me try it for you. Mm. Oh, so good. <laughs> so good. These actually are luxurious. Whatever that means for a candy, when you bite into this, you taste cream and strawberries. Almost like a strawberry and creamy kind of yogurt. It's got this sugar on the outside. It's a little bit crispy, but the inside is oh, so, so good. I can't even describe it. 
it almost tastes like a strawberry cheesecake or something really good. And the final, we get this raspberry pop. That looks beautiful. It doesn't even look like food. But we definitely have to try it. Probably what Tinkerbell and her friends have been eating all these years. Look at that. <laughs> and if this little box of goodies couldn't get any better. Oh, this is so good. Look at that. It's like a little picture of a raspberry. Tastes like raspberry and the white part tastes like cream. Almost tastes exactly like these little candies here. Oh, this was so, so good. I'm so happy I picked this up. On to the next. My favorite were like the chocolate buttons, and then I like this pop because like nothing's better than that. Yes, finally gonna see what real poopy tastes like. Or is it chocolate? We don't know yet. From those lovely candies to a big old swirly poo. Look at this, it's like a little poop on a stick. It's an emoji lolly. It's so, so cute. And I don't know what the flavor is. I'm sure it's not gonna be bad. I'm thinking it's chocolate. Give it a little taste. Watching me bubble. Better not start eating me poo. Love you. I'm a little scared for this one. I don't know the flavor. I hope it's not one of those gross candies that like gross you out. It looks like chocolate. That's all I'm thinking it is. Bubba, when you uncle breaking it on us like you always do, you're so rough with these candies. I'm gonna do it nice and slow. Ooh, the face came off. Ew. Ew. And it really has the face. The little face on there was a sticker on the wrapper. It's got the imprint. All right, here it goes. Super shiny. Mmm, tastes like root beer. Weird. It's got like a root beer flavor. I thought this was gonna be chocolate. No, way. it's like a fizzy soda. So weird, I wasn't expecting that. Even kind of tastes like cinnamon. Ugh. What's wrong with cinnamon, huh? What's wrong with cinnamon? I don't know, I'm not crazy about this. I love the last candy, but I'm not crazy about this. It's like a cinnamon soda, like maybe Dr. Pepper. Ugh, I don't know. I don't like the way it looks. Don't like the taste. You don't like root beer? You don't like this face? What's wrong with you? This is gonna be the best candy on your chopping block today. Oh, love it. Ooh, you're going for the spooky candy. That's like a little Harry Potter wizard girl. I'm not trying it. Well, I thought the last one was gonna be chocolate and it wasn't. It was like some weird soda flavor. So now I'm in the mood for a little choco. Here it is, shock o choc straight from Harry Potter World. I've never tried it before. We get some dark chocolate with chili powder. Ooh. <laughs> this is the weirdest thing ever. Mm. Just looks like chocolate. I don't see no chili powder here. What's going on with that? We get these little pieces. It looks so different than I thought it was going to look. I don't know. I thought it would be red. <laughs> but it looks like a regular chocolate. It's brown. Looks like little messed up pieces of chocolate bar. Try it. Doesn't look anything like I was expecting. Looks like a big old smash block of chocolate. Like chili? I don't think so. Let me try this. Ah, spicy! Whoa. <laughs> this thing is like, it tastes like Tabasco sauce. Actually, it's not that bad. I don't know. The combination of the chocolate and that spicy, spicy, almost like a red hot sauce is kind of good. You think that combo is kind of good? Like, you gotta get your head checked. Stop doing these candy bonanzas. Oh, it's so, so weird. I can't even describe it. Let me show you the inside. It doesn't look like anything. You don't see any chili or red hot, but it's so chocolatey. It's like a dark chocolate. And then as soon as you start biting it a little more, it hits you. That big old chili taste. It's like, it's just like Tabasco sauce. Tastes like a hot wing. Shaka chocs are crazy. Like this little girl is even more crazy. How would you eat that? Never thought I'd like these, but I definitely do. Ooh, I actually gotta try one of those chili hot chocolates. Probably gonna taste similar. I got a whole big bunch of these. Save them for later. Maybe I'll put them out for Christmas and the people will think they're chocolate and give them a little surprise. These were good. Not good at all? Get these little weirdo kids away. Oh, how thoughtful of you. After those horrible spicy candies, you brought something good. Next one up, ooh, I had to take some water. It took a huge chunk of that chocolate. It burned me, it burned my mouth. It's so spicy, but it was really good. So we get this bottle pop, the Christmas edition. Look at all these little decorations. Looks like a candy cane, but I don't think it's a mint flavor. We got some cherry vanilla. Pop it open. Bubbles, you're like so quick to do 
everything, but I noticed this for you. Like, look in here. There's something in there, in the pucker powder. Then I looked on this. We get a Christmas cues. A tattoo for the tongue. Isn't that crazy? Unbelievable. Look at this crazy thing here. So we get a little baby bottle top. Ah, oh, that looks so yummy. Mmm. Mm, gotta leave one of these out for Santa. He'll give us extra presents. So good. Wow, this is so good. I've never had a baby bottle top that tasted so good. It's cherry vanilla. It really is. Ah, oh, it's so good. It's not even too tarty or like sour. Mmm, tastes like strawberries and cream. So let me pop the top inside of this pucker powder to get a little surprise. A little Christmas surprise. Tongue tattoo. Tongue tattoo? Like, what is this world coming to? Like, seriously, why would you need to put that on your tongue? Crazy little Christmas tree. Ugh. Yeah, I don't feel like putting this on my tongue. I don't know why. Just because it looks like a real tattoo, it is gross. I'm sure it's just some kind of like a food coloring. Let me try it on my hand. See if it works. Nope, doesn't work. But I gotta dip this in here. I wonder what flavor this is. It's like a pink sugar. Mmm. Too good. That is like strawberry pucker powder. Almost like a pixie stick. Mix it with the cherry vanilla little bottle. Mmm. Best thing I ever tasted in my life. I'm just gonna drink this. Mmm. I was never a big fan of the bottle pop, but I am right now. Oh, this is so, so good. The mixture. I could literally finish this whole thing off. It's super sour. Almost like a strawberry or a cherry. Even like a little bit of vanilla. I think even the pucker powder is like strawberry vanilla. Then you get this little lolly to dip. Love it. I'm gonna save that for later. <laughs> we gotta put one of these out for Santa. He's gonna love this. Bubble, you're crazy. Like, why did you buy this? I just have a million questions. Like, why? Doesn't even look good. From Bottle Pop to the Botan Rice Candy. Oh, look at this little chubby baby. I don't know what's going on with this. I mean, I have no clue what it looks like. I thought the box was so cute. Comes with stickers. Check this out. I'm getting super nervous about this one because, like, you know I don't like rice. And, like, what is that? What is that? Time for the big reveal. Ooh, look at this thing. It's like a little cat. He's sniffing a flower. This is crazy. Let's see what's going on in this box. Ooh. Ooh, there's a bunch of them. Got our sticker. <laughs> that is a sticker. Like a little piggy sitting in an orange. So weird. So weird. Like, don't even get me started on these weird little candies. They look like cough drops. For real. Uh, is this the Botan candy? Like, what is going on here? So we got our little sticker. It's super cute. Little piggy. And these are the candies. They don't look anything like rice. They kind of look like a cough drop. Let's see. Ooh, they're filled with plastic. I'm scared of these things. I don't know. They don't look too good. Ah, it's all filled with plastic. Like, what do you mean it's all filled with plastic? Like the wrapper? Just like take it off. Just like this, you peel it. Don't you know that by now with your candy bonanzas? Ooh, it's tricky. Oh, what is that? Rice soup? Oh, <laughs> Ew, it's so, so gross. First of all, I could barely get the plastic off. Oh, I took a little taste. It tastes like, not even like sugar. It tastes like a raw piece of rice that you never cooked. It's not sweet, it's not sour. Just like the grossest thing ever. I don't know who would ever buy these things. At least we got this little prize. Oh, these are the worst. It just tastes like uncooked rice. Like, I love uncooked rice. This doesn't taste like uncooked rice. This tastes like medicine, okay? Here, like I'm picking the next candy. You can have your rice candy and I'm gonna have my jelly belly. Trolls edition, yes. Ooh, those last things were horrible. Don't know what they were. Don't know what they were about. Why did they even make those things? But now we're moving on to some Jelly Belly. And we got the Trolls Edition box. Look at all these flavors. Yes, let's take a look at these flavors. They're amazing. Berry blue and cotton candy mixed together. Mixed berry smoothie. Jewel very cherry. Ooh, it's like shiny. Orange sherbet. And plain old blueberry. Whoa. Let's unwrap these little babies and do the Jelly Belly taste test. <sighs> My favorite part, I usually always have jelly beans on these bonanzas. Ah, I can't open it, I can't get enough of them. What's going on with the plastic here? Not much going on with it, all you have to do is tear it off. Then you're good. Super simple. Why don't you ever get that? 
no, look, and they even have these little troll faces on here. Biggie, we get this one here. I always forget her name. We get Puppy Branch, these two little twinsies or whatever they are, pink and blue. Oh, gotta try them. Ooh, we have a little mix up. Okay, so we're starting. We're starting with the pink and blue, which is very blue and cotton candy. Like, nothing can taste better than that. Blue one, pink one. Mmm, mix them together like their hair. Ooh, those were good. Oh, so good. I think I like the pink one a little bit more. Maybe that was the cotton candy. Oh, really good. This kind of tasted like a blue snow cone. We're moving on to the branchy flavor. Mixed berry smoothie. Ooh, it's like purple with speckles. Mmm, that one tastes so good. It tasted like, like smoothie or like yogurt. Really creamy. Super good one. Did taste creamy. Actually did taste like a smoothie. I don't know how they make these things. Next one I'm most excited about. We get the Jewel Very Cherry. Now look at this. It kind of looks like a little ruby. It really looks like a piece of jewelry. Best one so far. Best one so far. And you know what? It's the poppy flavor. So like of course it's going to be the best one. Love her. My favorite so far. Oh, so good. Kind of even a little tarty or like can't describe it. Almost like sour, but not too sour. And these are so super shiny. Next one, orange sherbet. Ooh. Tastes like a fresh squeezed orange juice. Like a Florida orange. Delicious. Tropicana. Supposed to be her. I never know her name and she's got crazy teeth. Mm. Tasted just like juice. The next one is plain old blueberry for a little bigger. Try it. Too much blueberry, a little too, too strong. Didn't like that, didn't like the biggie flavor. So there it is, all the troll flavors. Ugh, I loved them all. The only one I didn't like was this blueberry. It was a little too strong, a little too sweet. I love the sherbet, I love the cotton candy. I think my absolute fave was the very cherry. So pretty, a little bit sour. These were the cutest, and they're in this cute little box. Amazing little stocking stuffer if you love trolls. Yummy. Say it isn't so, a giant gummy cola bottle. Like, yes! Got a couple giant candies in this bonanza. Oh, I'm so super excited. Who doesn't love this giant, huge candy? We get this half pound sugar daddy and a gummy cola bottle. I tried to make one of these ones. It didn't work out too good. So I bought it. Now we're gonna eat. Yummy. love gummy candies and cola you are in luck look at this thing you guys whoa it would have been cool if it was like 3d except the back of the bottle is flat ah, smells like pepsi smells like pepsi looks like pepsi but like what is this supposed to be like sprite or like ginger ale what is the top flavor let me try it top tastes like pineapple fanta fruit flavor let me try the bottom bottom tastes like cherry coke two giant bites out of this thing. Oh my gosh. The bites that I took were probably like 30 regular gummy bears. <gasps> this thing is so heavy. It's bendy and squishy. You know what? It's so weird. The bottom tasted like a cherry Coke. It's fizzy. It really tastes like soda. And the top tasted like a pineapple soda. Just the weirdest thing. You can hold it and twist it. See if we can squeeze the soda juice. <laughs> You're gonna like twist it to try to squeeze the soda juice? It's a gummy bubble, it's a gummy. It's not like a sponge. And you gotta go super simple with this because if you bite with your front teeth, I think it's gonna take them out. They're gonna be stuck in here. Woo, this thing is chewy, chewy, chewy. Oh my gosh, I think I had to get my squishy scissors. I gave them a nice clean. See if we could chop this thing up. It looks like chocolate now, but the weirdest thing, it's like a bottle of cherry cola. That's what it tastes like. Seriously, Bubble, you need a machete to like cut this. You're never gonna cut it with your little squishy scissors. Like never, maybe this tiny piece here, but not the bottom. Super strong, it's like unbreakable. It's like that big old gummy worm you had. Indestructible. Ooh, I pulled the bottom. Got my nail polish on there. <sighs> crazy. Ew, some of my nail polish wiped on here. What is going on? I actually, I don't like it too much. It's a little too tough and a little too chewy, but I love how it's super huge. And if you're having like a birthday party, I think it's the coolest thing. You can get a knife and slice it up, give it to your friends. But personally, I don't like it. Yeah, well, everybody's 
vegan bagels and cream cheese on Christmas morning. I'm gonna be eating this for breakfast. I'm saving it. Best thing ever. Percy, we tried some crazy mix of sweets today. We got two more left. We got the sugar daddy and this 14 different flavor gummy bears. Go for this one. Why do they call it a sugar daddy? Why don't they call it a sugar mommy? Don't get it. And these look like little strips of bacon. Is it bacon flavored or what? Here we go. I never had a sugar daddy in a box. This one is so ridiculous. It's so huge. Wow, it'll take your teeth out. Oh yeah, it's either gonna take your teeth out or I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna paddle my canoe. It's like a canoe paddle, huge. I'm sure it would work. Like, what's going on with this wooden stick? Come on. Another crazy thing I always thought was weird about a sugar daddy was how hard the caramel is. This feels like a brick. Aren't caramel supposed to be soft and chewy? Unwrap. Uh, are you serious? We get another wrapper and then another wrapper? Like, how much do they need? Come on. Ooh. Looks like it's from Honey, I Blew Up the Baby. Like he put it in the machine and just like made it for a giant. Whoa. <laughs> this thing is huge. It's bigger than I thought it was going to be. Oh, look at the caramel. I don't even think you can bend it. Ugh. Mm, that is so good. Tastes like butter. Tastes like margarine or toffee or something. Mm, gonna rip my teeth out. Mm, I took a little bite of the corner. You guys, this is so, so good. Probably, I would say maybe 20 or 30 regular sugar daddies in here. So good. If you take little bites at a time, your teeth will be okay. Bubble, you can like share this with your whole entire neighborhood. Like everybody gets a bite. I think like 200 people could eat this thing. Who doesn't love a sugar daddy pop? Looks like a wooden plank on a stick. Like, does this look edible? Really doesn't, but it is. It's so good. Ah, unbelievable. This thing could just like, I don't know. Woo! Congratulations, Bubble. You broke it like you break everything else. Good job. What are we going to do with this? It's not going to be on the stick. Can't even eat it. <laughs> I just slammed this on the table. I broke it. I thought it was indestructible. Look at that. It's such a hard caramel, but super delicious. I think it would last you a year. You just take little bites, wrap it up, save it. Sugar Daddy times a thousand. Really good. Well, the last one was almost like non-edible. So thank goodness you brought these gummy bears. Something we can actually eat. Not just regular gummies, like happy yummies. Final candy of the bananas. We got the big old bag of gummy bears. Ooh, this is the super bear assortment. Happy yummies. Look at all these colors. Let's look at the 12 flavor bears bubble since you're so lazy to do it. I'll do it. Wild cherry, orange, mango, strawberry, pink, grapefruit, ugh, lemon, lime, blue raz, watermelon, grape, green apple, and pineapple. Then we get those two extra special flavors. Black cherry, strawberry, banana. Like these things are insane. Pop this little bag it open. Actually, this gigantic bag of these gummy bears. And see all these crazy flavors. Ah! Look at this white one. Looks like white chocolate. Like, are you for real? Tons of gummies. Tons of gummies going on today. I got this big old lump of gummy. Then I got this little pile of bears right here. Actually, these are pretty big too. They have like a little A on there. Why do they have an A? Like for Alvin? Is that a chipmunk bear? I don't think I can try all 14 flames, but I'm gonna go for some good ones. I gotta start with the red. I always love a red gummy bear. Here goes. Mm, definitely the wild cherry, for sure. I'm going with this white one. Is it white chocolate flavor or like pineapple? Let's see. <sighs> Tasted two of them so far. This is winning. Tastes like a pina colada, like a little smoothie drink. So good, so pineapple-y. Even a little hint of coconut, like tropical. That is crazy. Try this one, it's like a blue-green. Squisher. Tasted like blueberry, nothing too special, but these are so good. They taste like there's fruit juice in here. They're really, really fruity. They have a lot more flavor than like a regular little gummy bear. Probably triple the size too. Gotta find me some mango. Maybe it's this one. Mango? <laughs> like, who eats a mango gummy bear bubble? You're cray. I'll taste it for ya. Mmm, tasted like papaya. So good, so good. Gonna try one more? I'm gonna go for that special flavor, the black cherry. Maybe this is it. Kinda purple. I could just sit and try these all day. I'm trying to match up the colors. I don't know what is what, but definitely my favorite was this pineapple. So, so good and creamy. Gummy bear party. Gummy bear party? Like not. Look at these little weirdos. Like look at them. Lined up in a row. Gonna eat you for dessert. This 
a sugar headache. Oh, I ate too much stuff today. I had a little more than I should have, and I loved it. I loved all this candy. Couple I didn't like. Probably I didn't like this Botan rice, whatever that was supposed to be. I also did not like the poop pop. It tasted weird, kind of like cinnamon. I didn't get it. Probably my favorite favorite two were these chili chocolates from the Harry Potter world. They were so good. Such a surprise. Never thought I could like anything like that. And I love this Christmas bottle pop. Cherry, vanilla, super sour. Oh yeah, well my fave was like the fairy food. And in particular, I love those little chocolate buttons and I love this raspberry pop. Like I'm definitely saving this to eat it. Oh, and like this one too. But now it looks kind of dangerous. Looks like an axe of caramel. Out of my little bubble teenies. I hope you enjoyed it. Maybe you want to try some of these candies. The troll little jelly bellies were so so good. And we are gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the show. And if you want to subscribe to our channel, just click this big yellow bubble with the bubble gum machine and subscribe. Have a great day, you guys. Bye.